Hello everyone, welcome back to Journey with Char on this lovely Thursday. I come to you today with some exciting items here um, that I got from Amazon. I'm so excited to share um, with you. I wanna go into seeing what my favorite items are for this summer. So anyway, this is a picnic blanket. And before we even get started, I wanna let you know that every item that I'm showing in this video, um, I am going to put the link down below. And I do have an affiliate with Amazon. If you do um, click on to that item, whatever item you're interested in, I do get a small commission from it and it does help my channel grow and um, just help support Journey with Char. So there we go. So I would appreciate that. Thank you so much. So here is the picnic blanket, y'all. Look how big this picnic blanket is. It's 80 by 80, this one. It is huge. I'm not going to open it all the way, but you guys, it is beautiful. What I love about it is that it is waterproof on one side, and then this, and it's very wipeable, but it's not where it doesn't seem like it's comfortable. Let me see if y'all can get that material up close. On one side, it is waterproof. You guys, it is huge, and I cannot wait, and I love the color of it. It's so pretty, and I cannot wait to take this on our own little picnic tomorrow so excited about that and, and I will put the link to that below okay now the other item that I got that I'm so excited about y'all she got the water bottle and it's right next to me and I'm so happy about it this one says good morning you see that what it says good morning it says hydrate yourself remember your goal keep chugging feeling awesome don't give up awesome I'm um, almost finished and you did it I thought this was too cute. Love the pink and the yellow. It's rubber at the bottom and it's also, you can remove it so that you can clean. I think this is just to protect the bottom of the bottle and it is just a beautiful feel. I don't know what you would say this feel is, but it's a frosted. It's like frosted and you just see the yellow and the pink and this is how you do the top. See that? And when you wanna chug, push it all the way back. It's not gonna break. And I have a little bit of lipstick on that. Absolutely love it. I'm so excited about this. What I love about it is that the straw goes all the way down to the bottom. You can get every last drop. And this right here is awesome because if you are walking or hiking, you can take that with you. Go on, on a hike, go on, on a hike. And you can have it, or even you can put a strap and have it strapped that way. But I just thought it was so cute and I absolutely love it. And I'm so happy about it. And it's easy clean, of course. Let me take that top off. See how the straw goes there. And let me just let you see what the bottom. See how the bottom of that straw look? And that bottom of that straw, see how it bends? It's hard for you to see right here. It bends so that you can get in there and get everything you need at that very last drop, okay? There we go. And then you just take that, put it through there like so. Take that straw, put it through there, and then just do a simple twist. Simple twist. And we are good to go. Now this is just for water, y'all. This is not for juice. This is not for wine. This is not for beer. <laughs> this is strictly for your nutrients, your nutrients, okay? I'm so happy I purchased this, so I will put the link below for this. They have many different colors. This pink and yellow is two of my favorite colors, so that's why I chose pink and yellow. Okay, so we know it's summertime. When it's summertime, what are we doing? We're pulling out the flip-flops, pulling out our sandals, but we need to make sure that the heels of our feet and the bottom of our feet is looking pretty good, right ladies? We wanna make sure we don't have any crack, desert cracks and, and tunnels and, and, and alleyways showing on the back of our feet, <laughs> okay? Especially on the bottom of my heels. So this is a product, it's by Prytech, I think. And that's that. And this is what it looks like on the back. Did you guys can see that? And I'm gonna open it really, really quickly. So you can see, I kinda look it a little bit. Some of these boxes sometimes are just the hardest thing. All right, here we go. And so it comes with a travel, little travel bag. Um, weekender, if you're going to, um, weekend, whatever, just for your travels. You can put this in, in, in a, um, your suitcase. It has a little travel. This is a little charger, just your standard little plug because it's an extra charger. It does come with a charger, which I think is awesome. And then we're gonna show you what the little 
roly, what do they call these? Um, rechargeable callus removers is what it is. Okay, so we're gonna look at these. And that is the charger that comes with it, which I think is awesome. It also comes with some little brush. I'm gonna figure out what this brush is for, but it comes with that. And then this is what the unit looks like, okay? So that is what it looks like. I love that it comes with a top to protect it. All right, easy removal, easy to snap on. And then it's got that beautiful, um, it's got that handle, the start. So we're gonna take that off and we're gonna see y'all, you can see the crystals on there. They shine up with the little diamond crystals, whatever they say. So let's see. Here we go. I'm not gonna put my hand on there, but I love that it has a little light at the bottom. But look at that, can you see that? Yes. Well, I cannot wait to use this. Ooh, it's like um, sandpaper. <laughs> yes, and so they have two other, um, this one looks like a, a, just a replacement of this one, it's a little darker. And then we have just this black one. So you can see the little diamond or whatever they call that. So I cannot wait to use this because she need a little help. She need a little help. We just don't realize how much we got to keep that really going back there at the bottom of those feet, at the bottom of our feet, because it can really get um, to the point to where um, you can, you can create, you know, calluses can come. That development of that skin, that rough skin. And so in between your feet, your foot appointments, your pedicures, ladies, you can do this in between. And so that is this right here, and it's by Prytech, okay? Cannot wait to use it. I will give my review about this very, very soon, okay? Very, very soon, I will give a review. I had a covering on my laptop. It was just a plain cover, and I said, you know what, I, I need something that's gonna keep me more motivated, just more visually beautiful. And yeah, these beautiful covers that come on these laptops, so I bought that. Isn't it pretty? Just apps, and you just snap it in. And that's what that looks like. And then it also comes with an extra keyboard cover. I got two that came with it. And that is the keyboard cover. How pretty and just girly is that? I just absolutely love it. And it just lays on your keyboard. There we go. Isn't that pretty? And then it also comes with a mouse pad. So I thought that that was really cute. And it was very, it was, um, very affordable it was nicely affordable it was not expensive so yeah that's the mouse pad it comes with and they come in so many different beautiful prints just look at that print that just makes you happy and then it comes with also the footing so that your it doesn't slip your little feet all right isn't that cute i absolutely love it okay so that was one of my other favorite items so you can take that computer the next thing okay i am always Y'all, she loves her tea cups, she loves her coffee cups, everything. So these did not come in here, they came in a cardboard, so I did put them in here to separate them. These are <laughs> coffee cups that mom and I are so excited about. We're gonna pull them out from here. And look how beautiful they are. I just gotta buy the sleeves. They're so pretty, so that's the tops to them. And these are the beautiful floral coffee cups, y'all. These are the four colors, so I'm gonna show you. That's a beautiful teal. Isn't that pretty? Just so pretty. And this is like a dark gray, okay? And then we have the beautiful light gray. That is just so pretty. And these sold out, so I had to get the one that had the more um, amount in it, but I absolutely love it. And that one is, is in pink. And they're just so pretty and just gorgeous and just girly and they come with the coffee top. Um, let me just show you what the coffee, just so you can get an idea. You just stick that right on top. When you're ready to go, get your little sleeve, and look how cute that is, okay? And they are disposable, of course, but sometimes you just don't feel like coming home washing the dishes, child. <laughs> so anyway, this is good for a cold beverage, a hot beverage, get a sleeve. We're gonna buy the sleeves. It's easy, you can get them from Amazon. Hot beverage, um, whatever, your hot chocolate, your tea, your coffee, whatever you decide to drink. I just thought that it was just so pretty and something quick and easy to grab with just some beautiful color and motivation 
to me, I just think that prints are just absolutely, they're encouraging, they're motivational to me. They just, they keep me going. Look how beautiful these prints are. Aren't they gorgeous? So yes. And they do have, they come in a set of 48 and I do believe a set of 18, don't quote me. And so I will have the link down below for these coffee cups as well. I just thought that they were so cute, something quick, um, quick and pretty. Take out the door, you ready to go? Going back to work. And there we go. Those are the coffee cups. Very, very cute. Okay, so the next thing we have here, y'all, she's gonna have to pick this camera up so I can show y'all. This is two items in here. I am so excited about to show y'all because like I told you, I'm going to call Bang tomorrow. She is a happy camper about this item. So I was looking for a picnic basket. And then I started thinking, she must be going to the beach a lot. She does not have time to be shaking a picnic basket, even though it's gonna be on the blanket. Picnic baskets are really pretty, and I'm gonna get one eventually um, for a set of four um, or two. Um, but I just thought that the idea of having a picnic basket, a picnic backpack is perfect. So this is a picnic backpack. Let me tell you who it's by. It's by Apollo Walker. How cute is this picnic bag? This picnic backpack, look how cute. I'm so excited about it. It is so durable. Oh my gosh, you guys, I was contemplating, contemplating. She said, girl, go ahead on and get the basket. So let's start. We're gonna make this really quick. So this right here is where you will put your wine bottle. And this is what this does that I think is genius. It detaches, okay? on both sides. If you wanna put the wine bottle in an ice bucket, you can still take it out, put it in an ice bucket. But if you wanna set this aside on its own by itself, you can set it aside. And it's got that Velcro there and those two snap attachments on each side there. And then in the inside, it is insulated. I know, right? It is insulated. And this looks like a standard, just a wine bottle or, bottle or um, your apple juice, Martinelli apple juice, because I don't drink wine. But to those who want like wine, this is perfect for that. And then these are the snaps that are on the side and the Velcro patch, you see that? So all you have to do when you want to put it back on is just snap that back on just like that. And put that Velcro there. And it's a nice Velcro too. You hear that? Put that there like so. And then just snap that right on back. And this is your wine compartment on the side of the bag. Okay, so cute. I absolutely love it. These are the wide straps. I absolutely love these adjustable wide straps. So you can easily, look at this. Look at, you can carry it this way or you can put it completely on your back. And this is perfect for hiking. If you have grandkids with you, look at that. It fits perfectly. You have your, your backpack and I'm just gonna turn around so you guys can see. It is so, oh my gosh, you guys. And I love the fact that it is adjustable. You can bring it tighter or you can bring it loose just like so. That's what that looks like, right? Perfect for camping, perfect for picnicking, perfect for um, hiking. Oh my goodness, absolutely amazing. Okay, so that is the adjustable strap. It's wide, it has like a mesh on one side and it's smooth on the other side. So let me show you what that mesh looks like. And it's very well made, you guys. All right, so let's go in on the back side. We have a, on the very top, that is the hardware. And the hardware is very nice, nice and sturdy hardware. So we're gonna go ahead on and open that and see what we have back here. She is more excited than ever. <laughs> you guys, oh my gosh, the gift that keeps on giving with this little backpack. This is an extra blanket. It's not as big as the 80 by 80 but perfect for, like I said, camping, picnicking, whatever it is. I'm not gonna open this up. There we go, it's pretty big. It's pretty big and it goes bigger than that. That's how big it is. So I will put the link down below if you're interested. And it is waterproof, because on one side you have that smooth and it is waterproof. It is a pretty big picnic blanket. So cute, perfect, perfect, perfect. 
Okay, so it just, it looks like it's easily, look how easy that is to fold right back up. Just like so. And there we go. And the compartment that this is in, seems like this is the more area. Now you can take this out and roll it up. And we're gonna do that later and try to put that on the side. Okay, we gotta roll it up really tight. So that's what this is for, to put the blanket in because you're gonna need this compartment for what food. Okay, so look how deep that is. I'm going to put my hand in there. Oh, that is pretty deep. You see that in here? I hope you guys can see that down in there. Pretty deep and it is insulated to keep your items cold or hot. Nice, and you can get a lot of different little containers and really organize your containers and put more cold or hot in here. And you can have another little um, bag, which I'm gonna show you here later, where you can even add more things to that. But this can be your major, where you have all your major um, dishes and your food, I mean, all your major food in there. So look at that. I'm gonna pick this camera. Well, I don't wanna miss the camera. But look how wide that is in there. Can y'all see that? There we go. And now what we're gonna do, we're not gonna put the blanket back in there because I'm gonna try to put the blanket on the side because that's what we're gonna use it for, right? All right, so that is the, let's put the blanket over here. She's too excited. All right, and so that was the inside where you put the food and everything. Another thing that I love about this bag is that you can pick, it's easy pick up by this little strap, but then also you have this. So if you're not carrying it with your backpack, you can utilize this. This is also a handle at the top. It's got that mesh and that smooth, so it's a nice, strong grip. I like that too, but I would prefer to do this because you don't want to do too much. Too much pull on in this. I don't care how well it's made. Can cause wear and tear. So, but in that uh, in that situation where you need to do it real quick, this is good that that is up there um, as an option, right? Okay, so this is the grand finale. Y'all ready for this? She is so excited. Oh, let me tell you this. Look at the pocket in the front with the beautiful hardware. You guys can see that. And I love that it has this little part, pocket in the front. Look at that. And my head is going way down in there. Look at that, okay? My whole forearm is almost way down in there. And I love this because you can put extra napkins, whatever extra you need, utensils or whatever, you can utilize this space in the front. You can even put your phone, whatever you, your iPad, your little um, map, little hand iPad, y'all know what I'm talking about. You can put all of that in there to utilize and keep it separated from the food and the liquids if you have that in there. Okay, so here we go. This is the grand finale, you guys ready? All right. Oh my goodness, look how beautiful that is, right? I know. All right, really quick, let's go through this. So up here, we look like we have a um, beautiful a wine opener, all that you need for bottle opener. I'll take that out in just a minute. So let's start with the salt and pepper shaker. Let's take that out nicely. That comes out so easy. I love it because, okay, it looks like, oh, it's open. But this is what you do. You take it and you turn it and it closes it. Isn't that adorable, you guys? I'm just too thrilled. I was gonna get um, the one um, that was glass, but I think it's more practical to have the plastic melamine when you're doing um, hiking and picnics um, or, or camping trips. I think it's more comfortable to have melamine. So that is the little salt and pepper, and it comes with two, so we don't have to pull that one out. I'm gonna pull out one of these spoons so you can see what the spoon looks like. Standard stainless steel. And then it's got that nice plastic handle, good grip on it, so that's one of the spoons. And then I'm gonna take out the knife. So this is more like a butter steak knife. Nice, sharp, very sharp, you guys. You wanna be careful. It has a plastic handle as well. You get four of the spoons for the steak knives. And then I did know that they did say that they had a cheese knife. So this is for different types of cheese. On one side, there's a certain fill on one side. And then you see the ridges on this side um, for cutting cheese or whatever meats or whatever you wanna cut. So I thought that that was awesome. So that is a difference. I wanna show you 
there is a difference between the regular um, knife, steak knife, and then your regular, like this type of cheese knife that they're choosing. Okay, and then you have that they have included. Okay, so then you have your fork, which is very, yes, very sharp. You can pick up any kind of meat, salad, pasta, fruit. Very, very nice. You get four of these, as you can see what is still left. And this is what they look like. And then I absolutely love that you get these cute, okay, you wanna come out. You get these cute drinking goblets. Now I've already went through this pack. I took all the plastic off, okay? I wanted to make sure nothing was scratched or cracked. But yes, these are your cute little drinking goblets. How adorable. They're probably about maybe, I don't know, a little under eight ounces. So cute, love the shape of that goblet. I can go ahead on and get, stick that back in there. Oh no, that's not a crack, that's there, a little mark. Okay, and then how cute. I love the mesh here to keep everything nice and sturdy and in place through transport. You can take this loose. This is very stretchable, so you can do it, well, I guess that that's about as far as it goes. But I love that it has that um, mesh and that strap with the um, Velcro to keep everything nice in place. These are the four napkins, how cute. I'm gonna wash these and then iron them, but they are tonight, but they are so adorable. Pretty big napkin, you guys. I mean, it keeps going, I'm not gonna undo it, but it's a pretty big napkin that you can probably sit in your lap and you should bring extra napkins just for the person to use for their, um, for the mouth and everything, everything. But yes, look at these beautiful napkins. I love the color. It's very fall looking too as well. And um, it's just really pretty. And then you have your plates and each plate has like a little, I'm gonna leave that because I like the fact that it protects it. But this is like a light melamine plate. It's a thin melamine plate, not very heavy, but it's light, but it's um, good enough to hold a strong item, maybe some chicken, fried chicken, if you have some pieces, a hamburger, a sandwich, a fruit. It's a really good sturdy little plate and I absolutely love them. You get four of those, let me stick that back in. And what I absolutely thought was genius and I love, so I'm gonna put this back in so you can see how easy it is to put everything back. Take the Velcro, snap that just like so. How cute is this cutting board? So this Velcro does not come snap. You just pull the cutting board out. And this is just like your little standard cutting board, the plastic kind, it's got the little grooves in it. Um, I would not cut things that will leave a um, um, stain or maybe a strong scent. I'll probably have those things already cut and, and, and put away in a little um, container. But this is perfect for cutting fruits, certain vegetables, certain cheeses that don't have too strong of a, male, of a smell. I think it's even cute to add as putting extra stuff on. You could put little desserts on top of this if you want to utilize it that way. But just the option that they put this little cutting board in here is so cute, absolutely adorable. So we're gonna go ahead on and put that back in there just like so. So that is everything in, back in snugly and put away nicely. So cute, I absolutely love this unit. And so we're gonna go ahead on and close this back. Just like so. Take this one. Love it, love it, love it. So now we're going to, I'm going to fold the blanket up and put it on the side, okay? So stay tuned. Okay, you guys, so we're going to do this really, really tight. Bring that around just like so and see if this fits. Okay, just coming through. We want to make sure the blanket is nice and snuggly. And I can probably even um, do him even, roll him even more tighter just to make sure. And then we have this one down here. Like that. And I'm telling you, honey, she put it about this tighter. But I'm just giving you guys a really quick review on how you can get this blanket down here. Okay, and these are the adjustable straps here. You can, this is just giving you an idea of what it looks like on top. I mean, all put together. All right, you guys, so this is it. This is what it looks like with the attached. Um, um, the blanket on the side, like I said, you can make this much more tighter 
because I got it in really full and it was really in You really have to make this tight, but it will fit. This is just to give you an idea of what that looks like. And there we go. Let's go spin this around again so you all can see. Isn't that beautiful? Absolutely love it. And I just think this was an awesome box. So I bought this beautiful piece from Amazon and I absolutely love it. I got it for, I think it was for 39. I will put the link below so that you all can see it. I've been having this for about two weeks now and I wanted to make sure that it stood up and it does, it delivers. This came folded at the bottom, which is really strange. You would think it would not be that strong because it came folded. But once you unfold it, it's such an easy assemble. You just unfold it and put the top on. So let me let you see. This is like a tuffeted top here. And it's like a velvet filling um, material. And it's easy to clean and wipe because this top is so heavy as you guys can see. See how heavy that is? It is very heavy. Some items, um, one, uh, some of these um, benches slash trunks um, I saw online, they were $65. This one was 30 something and let me tell you, it is amazing. So I've just filled it with just a few little stuff in here. As you can see, it's very deep down in here. I have a few, I have like my little money coins in here. I have a couple little containers. I have this thing um, that I use on my face. I have a game system here, my ear pods in here, my Bible, my journal, there's a Bible here. And I'm just going to put, these are filters for my mask. I'm just gonna put Reese's book down in there, my Blondie Ray book down in there. As you can see, it's so filling. Look how much of my arm is down in there, you guys. So you can really utilize this and put blankets, um, sheets, perfect for um, toys in your little girl's room. You can put all of her little toys away. Um, I just think it's perfect and this is detachable. It's not together. Lift that up so they don't think that it's together. It's completely detachable. But look how sturdy this is. And I think it holds up to 300 pounds, but she's not gonna sit on it. Um, and so this is how it goes on smoothly. I absolutely love the fact that it is easy to clean. This is another item that I got from Amazon. I have been wanting one of these charcuterie boards, um, especially to take on travel. This is a charcuterie board. I am so excited. It's charcuterie cheese board, fruit serving tray, cheese board guide, and steel cutlery is what's in this um, item. It is a premier, premium bamboo cheese board by Smurly, and I'm so excited. So let's get into this, you guys. I'm going to take this, and I'm going to show you. So stay tuned. All right, this is the box the cheese board comes in. Let's get that very nice box. At first, I thought that those were marks, but they are not. So yes, very nice premium cheese board serving box. This is the size of the cheese board. For those of you who are interested, we're gonna do this really quick. And I already opened this and went through it last night. They gave me a nice big thank you card, which I thought was awesome. This is there if you're happy. That's it, terrific. And if you are unhappy, there we go, that's there their promise to you. Okay, and we're gonna take this plastic off here. It does give you a cheese board, perfecting the art of cheese board, the essential guide by Smurly. And I thought that this was awesome. So when you open it, it just gives you a nice um, idea, option idea of how to do a good cheese board, an appropriate cheese board. Mozzarella brie, Gouda, blue cheese, Manchego, Gruyere, aged cheddar, Parmesan. Ooh, and it tells you it's salty and nutty, sweetened and salty, sharp and rich. I absolutely love that. And then it gets just gives you the fruits and the um, savory olives and the different um, cr um, nuts and fruits and meats that you can put on your charcuterie board. Your different breads and crackers and chips. And for those of you who drink wine, these are different options of wines that are good paired with different cheeses, which I absolutely love. Uh, this was adorable so cute okay and that is the cheese board that comes with that cheese board um, the essential guy that comes with this set okay now here we go this is your little board you can feel in here different fruits here 
all kinds of fruits, sweets, nuts. You can utilize this board for that. I love it. It's bamboo. It's got a good weight to it. It's heavy. It's well made. I absolutely love it. I just love this. It's so nice and heavy. You hear that? And so this, I'm going to keep. But we're going to lift this out very neatly. They have this so neatly packaged. These are the cute little ramekins that you can put jams, whatever kind of jam or jelly or honey you want to use. You can even use it for olives, whatever you want to use it for, nuts. They go here, just like so, okay? But before we do that, we're gonna to need to take the board out so that you guys can see one of the reasons of why I chose this board and I love it so much. So we go ahead and get it out. It is very heavy and so this, this is the board, okay? Isn't that beautiful? What I love about it, you stick these two little ramekin like um, holders, you put them there in the corner, you put them there on the corners, and you can fill them with whatever you decide you want to put in those. This can be set on the side, you have your fruits, your vegetables, your, your um, fr um, cherries and your blueberries and strawberries whatever you decide to put there what i love about it this right here has a nice pull out look at this you can even utilize this space for crackers or sliced cheese or whatever you decide to put some little breads you guys look at the cute cutlery it is so adorable absolutely love them i'm gonna show you each night here we go how sharp that little edge is, right? And I love the little handles. Nice grip, get in there and get that cheese out. Then we have the one that is sharp. You wanna be careful. These are very sharp. Look at that one. Look at cute. I love the wide handles. You get a good grip when you're messing with something sharp. This one is like a little pitchfork. <laughs> so cute. Absolutely love it. And you wanna make sure children, of course, never this is always needs to be utilized by adults only, not children, because these are short, very sharp gadgets. So cute, I'm sure you guys already know that, just to say that. And then I love the fact that it has these little pins that are like chalk, so you're not getting chalk all over your hand. So they're like little pins. And look at that, isn't that cute? And you can just write, I love that it has that sharp little edge to it. It's a chalk pin, okay? And then these are the little, the little, um, that you can write what type of cheese. And this is like some kind of stoneware. Yeah, this, where you can write what kind of cheese you have. You guys know what material this is. Some people even have this on their um, countertops. And you just stick that in the cheese. I just think that's ever so elegant. And you get two, and you get two of those. And I just think it's just so cute. Absolutely adorable. That is what the unit looks like. And I'm going to push this back in and it's easily to clean, I'm sure. And I'm sure there's some things you need to do to oil it. If you use oily um, meats, I would probably put something down first so that it doesn't sink into um, the wood. So you gotta really figure out how to better take care of this. You can put different cheeses, different things. Um, but you wanna just make sure that you don't put anything that'll discolor it or that will cause it to have spots. So we have to really figure out. Bamboo is really good to take care of, so just look that up. But you can put that on top just like so if you want it like that, but I think utilize this, that's what it's there for. Transportable, I absolutely love that and cannot wait to utilize it. And there's the swirly, the smurly signature. They got it stamped there, and there it goes. Absolutely adorable, okay? All right, you guys, so that is my charcuterie board. And like I said, this is even perfect for um, Christmas parties, Thanksgiving, um, housewarming parties, perfect housewarming gifts to give to someone that you know loves to entertain, um, couples. Um, it's just a very nice wedding gift. So many different options that you can give this as a gift or you know, just to have gift yourself, like I did, and so for me and my family. So that is the cheese board again. All right, I'm so excited about that and cannot wait to use it. All right, you guys, so last but not least, I needed to get a tea pot because she is, sometimes she does not feel like getting out of bed. Bed, she does not even feel like leaving her room. 
So I think it's good to have something that you can put water in right next to your bed. Okay, you guys, so this is the Morocco, I believe it's called, and it is an electric tea kettle. Okay, that is the heating unit at the bottom, and it does come with the base. I'm gonna show you in just a minute. I needed something where I can have it in, if you need it in your bathroom, if you need it, if you want a cup of tea in your bedroom, um, wherever you are in your house, and you don't feel like coming back to the kitchen to get it off the stove, honey, you can take this with you wherever you are, plug it up, put your water in, and voila, you have some tea. So I'm gonna go ahead on and take, grab you all, and I'm gonna show you what it looks like, so stay tuned. All right, there we go. This is what it looks like. And I'm going to show you the base. That is the base. And it's really easy to pick up. It's not, it doesn't lock it in. It's real easy to pick up, okay? And then we're going to press this button. This is going to open. And a lot of people were saying, oh, I don't like it because it rusted and yada, yada, yada. So I said, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead on and try it myself. I've been having this for about maybe about three weeks now and it has not rusted as you can see. I think what you need to do is make sure you really get all of the water particles out of it and make sure that you air dry it just in case there's some extra water you did not see. Once you close it, if there's water, it's going to rust. We're gonna go ahead on and pour some water in just so you guys can see how quick this thing gets going and I'm so excited about it y'all oh I'm so happy she has been enjoying this so we're gonna go ahead and press this button down it's already started y'all hear that listen just so you can see look at it. it's already bubbling down in there see that listen to it that fast right I know she was just the happiest camper when she found out <laughs> How hot this thing gets. Look at that. You hear that? That is amazing. And you can use this for coffee, for tea. I am going to get a gooseneck. There's a store that specializes in goosenecks in the mall. I'm going to check that out before I decide. But let's open this. Look at the steam coming out of there. Whoa. Okay, so in order to just turn it off, this thing, you know, the temperature, I don't want to burn my tea. Some teas are certain temperatures, this does not tell you that but you have to figure that out yourself. But just look at the steam in there. So we're gonna take that off there. And we're gonna pour that so y'all can see. Maybe it'd be nice if I go ahead and close that top. <laughs> and we're gonna go ahead on and pour. Look at that. Look at the steam. This is what I'm talking about. Fast, quick, if you want a nice cup of hot chocolate, you want a nice cup of tea, you want a nice cup of um, coffee, you may wanna do some um, um, instant coffee, this is perfect for you. Absolutely love it. And that is the Morocco, that's the brand of it, that's the brand of it right there, Morocco. And she was just too excited about it. All right, you all, so that is everything. I gotta dry this out so that it does not get any kind of stains. I hope you all enjoyed this little haul with me. And like I said, I will put every item that I can find down below, the link down below. And if you're interested in anything, go ahead and hit that link and it'll take you directly to that item. And I do get some commission from it because I'm an affiliate. And that will also help my channel grow and help my channel out. So thank you so much for um, your love and your support and your help. I'm trying to get my channel to grow, 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 you guys. And I really do appreciate everything you do. When you click the like button, please start hitting if you can, I would really appreciate it if you can hit that like button um, because of the rhythm. What is the algorithm with YouTube? Um, they they really do look at your likes. They look at your comments. So if you all can put your comments in and also hit that like button, I would really appreciate it. And I love commenting back to you guys. As you can see, look at my other videos. I'm talking to everybody. <laughs> anyway, so thank you so much for tuning in. You all be blessed. I um, hope you liked what I showed today. And if you have any questions, please ask them down below and I'll do the best in answering them. And thank you so much for tuning in. Um, you all be blessed. Take care of one another. Remember always, trust God, keep him first, and he'll always lead you in the right direction. And don't forget to drink your water, you guys. This thing is amazing. All right, I'll see you soon. God bless. Bye-bye.